The first functional area we will focus on is for Creative Arts Area 7. However, before we start, let's reflect on the principle of developmentally appropriate practice. Based on what you learned from last week, developmentally appropriate practice, or DAP, is the practice of focusing on what is doing best for children rather than focusing on what is right or wrong. Take a look at this picture. What do you see? You probably see a small child holding a pan filled with mud while she is covered in mud. What did you think she may be doing with it? You probably focused first on her appearance and then noticed the sign, or you may have noticed the sign and then her. But how did it make you feel as a teacher? Some of you are probably turned off by the thought of lots of small children playing in mud and others may have thought, how cool, I wish I had been there. Regardless of how you might feel towards an activity or an experience, the important thing to keep in mind is what the children can gain from the experience. In this particular event, there weren't many limitations, so children could get as imaginative and as dirty as they wanted. The more children are allowed to explore, the more they learn. In the following weeks, starting with lessons on creative arts, you will find that this is a key piece to children's learning, providing quality hands-on experiences that promote exploration and inquiry versus teacher-guided activities. So it will be helpful to keep these questions in mind as we really discuss and learn what developmentally appropriate practice means in each of the functional areas. Think about what DAP means to you. How do you feel children learn best? What is your personal philosophy and the philosophy for the center you work for? How does it guide what you do with young children? Should you change your approach, change how you plan, or the questions you ask? Try to think in terms of what you're already doing as a great foundation, but how can you make it a better experience for children? For your first activity this week, you will be divided into three groups and provided instructions. Complete the activity and share your experience on the discussion board entitled DAP with Art.